This episode is brought to you by the power of Google. No jokes, just search results. Use Google today. Everybody loves Google. Happy birthday, Google. 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 Long live Google. Long live Google. Google. Welcome back to Let's Play Sonic Adventure 2. And uh, hey, check out the file there. Uh -huh. Sonic did Pumpkin Hill. That's a little oh. strange, don't you think? That's you can choose. That's interesting that it actually kept it. You can change various items. Yeah, I mean, menu screens. It, that's the, what the game recognized as the character. It's like they recognize. Oh, Sonic was the last one who did that. Probably because it just defaulted to that, like we already established. But wouldn't it just like try to destroy itself? Because that can't happen. Well, it happened. Okay. All right, next up, next up is Metal Harbor, and it's a Sonic stage. Ready for a Sonic stage? It's a Sonic stage because it's Sonic stage, and here is Sonic. Oh, good. It's time for a bathroom break. I'll be right back. I know I should have. Uh, that's Shadow. I mean, that's I know Shadow. I should have waited until you know before we started recording to uh, to think about this. But you know what? I'm just thinking. You know, maybe I should do some shopping. What's eBay got? What's Amazon currently advertising to me? Well, uh, for those of you who don't have another tab open. Or, or do have another tab open. Um, you're probably wondering what those numbers at the bottom are. Interesting. I have added yet another code. Wait, wait, is that debug mode I see? This is debug mode. Oh, yes! I don't know what to do with it Shit! yet. Shit! <laughs> All right, back to my other tabs. I don't know, I don't know what to do with it yet. I mean, I'm thinking that maybe something will happen if I do some, oops. If I uh, do some weird stuff, but you know, maybe be a way to monitor what's actually going Holy on shit. in the game a little bit. Oops! Oops! Holy oh. shit! Oh, there we go. <laughs> I always love these levels where, whoa, like, fi whoa! Like five seconds in, you just lose control of the entire thing. Like it's gone. There's no way for you to technically finish it, and you're not getting through that. I or you are going through that. You're just not gonna be solid on it anymore. That's just background. That, that, that's background too, but that's the rocket silo. Are they using the whole stage to make us think that we're actually going around just one area? I mean, is it is just a whole bunch of clever visual cues? I don't, I don't know. Actually, you know it'd be interesting if the like if the solidity of the level changed based on what camera angle you were looking at. So just imagine if you're looking at it from the way you were when you were just flying out there in the ocean. That's when it was background, but as soon as the camera angle turned around, it became solid level. Yeah, good luck programming that garbage. Well, I mean, they had to cut corners, didn't they? It's old, old technology. <laughs> like, why would we ever do that? Why don't we just keep it background? You're fired. <laughs> no, but no, I'm the sir. senior. <laughs> I'm the senior lead director. Oh, you're rehired. And that's why oh, you're gone. Oh shit. Oh, no! Oh, uh, well, here we go again. Later. Well, this is nice. You think we might end up in the first level of Sonic 06 if we keep going in this route? Nope, we're going down to those depths, though. Darn. Mm. And all of a Lot sudden, of we're in Sonic 4! Splash Hill Zone. No! Boy, Shadow, you're not really a good fit for this level so far. <laughs> I'm gonna go through a rocket, so I can destroy all those damn Chaos Emeralds. I've gotta grab onto a rocket, too. Sonic is not gonna one-up my edginess. So wait, I just thought of something. Who's gonna take care of the Chow after this? Who is this technically? Ah, fuck. Ha! So, uh, while Shadow's struggling to go to the goal here, and, uh, shit. Stop anyway. that! <laughs> um, I figured out through, uh, Did you know Gaming that Shadow the Hedgehog's gun havingness was fan requested? What? Yeah, apparently. Like, uh, younger kids wanted to see Sonic with the gun. It's like, well, we thought Shadow would be a better fit, which is, which is what I've been saying all this time. So, uh, I'm thinking, well, they, they wanted to put a darker spin on, Sh on Sonic the Hedgehog, which, to be honest, I'm not all really against. That might be not, that might not be too bad. What if they, uh, edge up Knuckles' raps a little bit? <laughs> I like it. Oh, you have no idea how much I like that idea. 
Just call it Knuckles Bulletproof. <laughs> I just think, you know, first mission, he has to go to a laundromat, go inside, unlock the doors, and then go back outside the laundromat. Boom. First mission done. Wait, if I something, something's happening. Oh, near Polly is many? What the hell huh. does that mean? Huh. So in debug mode, can you get a translator? Try to figure out what all this technical speak is. I don't know. I'm gonna see if I can figure some of it out. Oh, hey, there's a rocket. Oh, wait. Can you actually? Yes! Let's see if I can get on. Uh, uh, here we go! Oh. Oh, I have to, have to actually trigger it before we get up. Damn it! That's alright, we got gravity on our side. There we go. Oh, shit! <laughs> Okay, fine. So, so I'm thinking, that edgier Knuckles game, uh, all you gotta do is just take Def Jam, fight for New York, and then give it a sonic spin, and then there you go, you're, you're in the clear. So people will go back to liking Def Jam, and then, you, you know what, I think modders have already done that. I'm gonna look that up real quick. Have modders put Sonic and friends into, like, edgy games? Dead Space! Def Jam Icon, Sonic Mod. You know, I'll take it. Even though that game was absolute garbage. Hold on, I'll do GTA after this. Well, of course there's gonna be a Sonic Mod for GTA. Who's hey, that's the first one, finally. Alright, let's move on to the second one. Oh, that guy looks like an idiot. Uh, no, nothing there. How about, uh... How about 50 Cent? I like that idea. <laughs> 50 Cent Sonic Mod. What the hell? Well, that's a mod for you. Yeah, you think about the, uh, the storyline to 50 Cent Blood on the Sand. It's kind of... It could be easily worked to be a Knuckles story. <laughs> yeah, they got my skull. They got my Master Emerald. They got my, mas <laughs> they got my Master Emerald. So, yeah, it, it translates pretty good. And he's got to get his crew that nobody really likes or cares about, in this case, Chaotix, and go Ooh. across uh, the sands and destroy an evil dictator, Eggman. Dude. Oh, who of you out there knows how to work technology? Let's get a mod going. Oh, and, then we need, uh... We need to get uh, some uh, fan remixers, get, like, the nastiest, <laughs> dirtiest, grimiest raps that, to give Knuckles. It's, I mean, I'm talking like fucking horrorcore if you have to. <laughs> no, I'm down with it. We can make like, this. I, I take that roots to black. I get the bat bat go splat splat on a fucking hat. <laughs> oh, wait, there hey, we go. Sonic Generation Shadow Mod download. Everybody in Chaotix plus Knuckles has a gun, like a shotgun. Even Charmy the Bee has a shotgun, which is Charmy really the funny bee, to me. Charmy the Bee, Charmy the Bee, Charmy the Bee, fuck. Oh, that's hilarious. And uh, you know what else is really fucking funny? I typed in Google 50 Cent Sonic Mod. One of the first images is, uh, is like, Super Amy. She's, like, all glowy and everything. And it looks like a Sonic Generations mod. But then I kind of, you know, I'm scrolling down here, and I'm seeing a bunch of, like, fan-made mods, and they look really bad. And then you get Bruno Mars versus Sonic the Hedgehog. I don't know how that even works. Oh, man, Sonic's doomed. There's no way you can be Bruno Mars. He's got that uptown funk. You got nothing, Sonic. He's gonna drop a grenade on you. <laughs> He's gonna make love like a gorilla to you, Sonic. You can't beat that. That was terrible. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry I no. couldn't think of anything else. Not you, me. That was pretty good. I liked I liked Gorilla. That was uh that was yeah. <laughs> I'm just, gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna treasure that. Damn it! I was just about to use that one. <laughs> oh, you can eat my dick. That's 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 not a Bruno Mars song. I, sorry, I got a little lazy on that one. <laughs> no, no, you were pretty good. Actually, that insult was a little bit lazy. The lazy right, song, I, if you I catch me. I just said lazy. <laughs> Fuck you! I didn't Fuck hear you. it, so it didn't happen. <laughs> oh, here we go. Here's a somebody made a mod. It's called Mario Adventure DX Director's Cut. It says like a total chaos, and you know it's got Mario Finally. Sunshine, Mario there. Yeah, 
And, uh, oh, Grand Theft Auto 5 mod, where you can be Sanic. Total MLG, bro. I love it when Mario and Sonic have these mods where they use really explicit language. <laughs> Wait, what's this? Wait. It's like... It's like a, a fan-drawn Sonic. He's like he's like green and everything. I don't I don't think I'll give you this image to use in the video just so I I don't want to insult anybody. It's like a green edge hedgehog, and he's got like gashes across his chest because you know he's all edgy, and it's got like canceled in front of the original Sonic the Hedgehog title screen. So I don't know what he's going for there. I'm better than Sonic. My games are better. <laughs> Because they have pretty good 3D and, and good first-person modes and... Oh, shit. Whoa. Okay. Okay. Recover. Let's see. How about Shadow Mod? 50 Cent Shadow Mod. <laughs> Is that 50 Cent? Like, tackling Hitman? Like, Agent 47? Why do you think that Shadow would be in 50 Cent? Is it because he's black? Yes! No. No! No, I wouldn't it, do that. Or is it because he has guns? Because he's got guns! Actually, it's because of all the fur. Oh, okay, yeah, right, right. What other I mean, games would have... Just, just be like, 50, 50 cents like, you know, Yo, I love Shadow Hedgehog. That shit for real, man. So Where that damn full Chaos Emerald? You know, I don't think that <laughs> motherfucker ever found it. Oh, this is terrible. This is terrible. Oh, why did I look this up? This is so bad. Left 4 Dead Sonic mods. Why oh, do I keep God. doing this to myself? Ah! <laughs> oh, that's so bad. But you know what's kind of kind of a little bit worse is somebody thought that was a really good idea, so they did like a Left for Sonic kind of thing, and it's got Tails like holding like a pistol in the foreground while everybody else is like looking at their guns, going yeah. Well, you know Sonic is a bit of an asshat because he's the fastest thing alive. He'd be like, all right, so here we go. Boom! Sonic's in the safe house already. Come on, guys, let's go! <laughs> and then they got Sonic versus Shrek for some reason because MLG is a plague. There's a lot of versus stuff here. What the hell is going on? And down we go. Oh, good. Vocaloid survivors and Tails. God damn. Really? Oh, wow, that looks cool. All, all right, Vocaloids, so I can have Moe girls talk to me in bleep bloopy crap voices. <laughs> Ain't got time for this, Ellis. <laughs> well, hey, we only got two minutes to talk about how much I hate Vocaloids. I hate Vocaloids, the end. That was a really good wrap-up, and I'm very glad you went through all the talking points. But why? Freddy Fazbear versus Johnny Bravo. You know, I'd watch it. <laughs> <laughs> There's a lot of shit on YouTube. I, well, I'm gonna save that for you. You, you might have to use this now. That is a strange way to uh, bring back the Johnny Bravo versus the Master of All Time type thing. <laughs> oh, Jesus. Like, even Johnny Bravo's confused as to why he's in this. <laughs> it's like, why am I fighting a bear, mama? <laughs> Are you one of them sexy mamas in that costume? Maybe if I take off that costume, we can get down to the nitty gritty. <laughs> uh, it writes itself. Look at that security camera, looking it straight at me, because I'm so pretty. <laughs> and jo I, I think Johnny would be strong enough to actually hold the doors down, too. <laughs> yeah, because... That's something that's never touched on in the show, is he's actually buff. He's he's strong enough to do a lot of this stuff. Yeah, that's how he gets his ass kicked all the time. Oh, I got about uh, 30 okay. seconds. Let's, oh, oh, can't go on this rock. I want to go on another rocket. Maybe this one will actually take me to space. Hmm, let's see. Ah, oh, well. Let's see, how can I ruin childhoods? Um, Eight. heart... Seven, six, network, anime. Uh, okay. Oh dear. There we go. Let's see how much time I had left. Five milliseconds? <laughs> wow, good job. That was cool. That was cool, Sonic. I'm glad someone agrees. Good job, man.
silence. <laughs> okay, so I did uh, I did myself a favor and uh, looked up something that I didn't want to see. Uh, you know how a lot of people have like fan art where they draw old fashioned cartoon animation and draw it like anime style. No. So I just figured like how how deep does the rabbit hole go? And you got some good ones. You got like Adventure Time, which is okay. Uh, Powerpuff Girls was already turned into that. Into that. Uh, that's a, that's a, that's a thing. That's a real thing. Yeah, it's a real thing. So that one counts. But probably one of the coolest ones, and I don't say that often, is actually um, the Grim Reaper from the Grim Adventures of Billy and Mandy. <laughs> that actually looks kind of cool. Here, let me uh, let me find you a visual example. Just because you know what, I I'm okay with that one. But everything else can just go away. Go back to Tumblr, please. I like how Billy is still the same. <laughs> well, I mean, you, you can't anime that anymore. Billy, how come you're not animified? This is my anime style. <laughs> oh wow! And then you got I, people who like. I cannot do. I cannot do Richard Horvitz's voice justice. I just cannot. It is so hard to do. It he, is. He that, has that, a tone all of his own, and it's amazing. That gentleman is one of a kind, just like Charlie Adler. <laughs> Charlie Adler, I found out the, the more I watch the Nickelodeon shows and planning on reviewing, I hear him everywhere. Oh, there it is. Oh, there you go. Good. God, there's so many, like... Why? Why? Well, I'm glad we're uh, looking up uh, crack pairings and discovering the deepest horrors of the internet while we're doing this simple cheating let's play. <laughs> well, I mean, at this point, it's just going to be the same thing, like going off into the abyss, dying, messing with the camera. So I figure, you know, lighten it up a little bit. Well, you think that this is going to be the one where it crashes again? Ooh. You have no idea what I have planned, because I've decided to add another chow. Really? Yeah, we'll do that next time. Uh, oh, okay, okay. Uh, I just want to get your attention back to this Let's Play! Come on, guys! Let's go! <laughs> Enough waiting. with the fan art! Enough with the fan art! Enough with the crack pairings! Let's get to serious business. We're about I'm done here. Waiting on bated breath. You, you can go back to your... Sick Tumblr pairings or your deviant ness or whatever. You can do all, no. you can do all that a after the show, okay? Just, we'll get to that. Steven Universe and Attack on Titan. All right, I'm done. I'm done. <laughs> That's good enough. I don't need any more. Here we go. Well, all right. Don't um, want it. Don't want it. Don't need it. You think Steven will taste good? <laughs> he tastes like stardust and rainbows. I don't think there's any situation that can't get better by adding a titan coming out of nowhere. <laughs> you know what? I completely agree with that. It's like, you know, Sonic is going on this fucking rocket, and then all oh, of a yeah, sudden you just see... Titan comes you just see a, a hand just you know, ups and grabs it like a pencil. Just, yes! And then he throws it back down, and then you, Sonic... <laughs> All right, there's a crossover for you. Sonic and Attack on Titan. Holy but first, shit. let's go. Let's uh, go up a little bit first. <laughs> okay, okay, no, that's fine. But while you just gave me the best idea ever, on uh, Titan, attack, attack on Title, Sonic. Oh that shit. Way we, that way we can finally get rid of Charmy the Bee. Yeah. Oh, and no. Shave off some of the characters you don't like. You know, like Shade, Styx, Marine. Um, it can get played, but it's all right. But we could totally get rid of fucking. Uh... That was cool. Okay. Keep Blaze. You can, you can have Rouge. You can, uh, he can eat Rouge. That'll be the one that everyone's like, oh. And there we go. Oh, no. Uh... Uh, okay. <laughs> some of these are really bad. Oh, good. Levi the Hedgehog. Let's take one of the best characters and uh, put him in a Sonic suit. Yeah! But for some reason, the debug text is strange in the Chow world. Ooh, wow. Maybe it doesn't like you here. It does not like this. Well, no nothing weird happens. That I can guarantee. Nothing really strange happens. It's just... Again, I don't know what this does yet.
I just don't know what it does yet. Yep. So let's see. Uh, I was just waiting for you. Because you set me up for a lot of things. You set me up for so many things. <laughs> and I was just expecting that green chow over there in the corner to start like going through the ceiling. Or something like that. I'm waiting for it. I'm always expecting things when I do a video with you. Oh, don't worry. we still got plenty of Sonic 2 left to go. It's probably okay. going to be more than 50 episodes, so you're not out of oh, the woods man. yet. There's still a lot to do, and we have to go through this emblem slog together. And I promise the end result will be worth it. <laughs> Again, please don't spoil what it actually is, otherwise I'll have to block you in Camellia com Rest. And I don't want to do that to you guys, so please keep it a secret for people who don't know what it is. Or if you really want to know what it is, you know, look up on GameFAQs yourself, you cheating fuck. You know keep yourself in suspense or whatever. Of course, then again, this game is like 15 years old, so it's not You're like it would really make that me. much of, of a difference, you know, so you could probably just do that. Me. So, uh, you know, hey, uh, what? <laughs> what did you find? <laughs> okay. I did this as a joke! I didn't think someone would actually make it! You went, you went into the rabbit hole a little bit too far, didn't you? I went too far! I was like, there's no fucking way nobody would do this! Weary traveler, tell me of your of your anguish. <laughs> I think you've been watching too many cartoons. <laughs> what are you doing, Stu? Defeating all the titans and making chocolate pudding. It's four o'clock in the morning. Why on earth are you defeating the Titans? <laughs> I will extinguish every last one of them, Deed. You don't understand. <laughs> because Angelica asked me to. Well, Armin would make a great Chucky. <laughs> That'd be cool. See that. Phil and Lil, you know, of course, Phil has to die. <laughs> oh, why? Oh, he has wait. to get tra tragically eaten. Philip! And then she gets eaten, too. Oh, there, there's actually a character pair like that. Okay, I see it. I see it. Dun 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 With a rock theme song in the background. Again, just looking at that tunnel right there, all I would just make the perfect is just... A titan man. A titan face. Just one of those... Oh, yeah, like the scary titan. The face titan. I love that guy. Yeah, that, that guy's probably my favorite. Just The Titans make it all worthwhile. If it, if it weren't for the Titans, I would have passed it off as blase anime, emotionally ma manipulative garbage. But the Titans make it all worthwhile because I'm on their side! Yeah! You, you eat those archetypes! <laughs> Moe hey, chick, well, you're going to my stomach! <laughs> I think you're actually the first person I've, I've seen who actually thinks of them as like, like basic archetypes. Like there's something to them. Well, something. they're better. Than, they're better than a lot of their counterparts, but uh, you know, there were a lot of really good moments too. What? Wait. What? Why is he crying? Up. Uh, what'd you do? Oh, he doesn't like scary Titan. You know, put oh, him away. Oh. Oh. Yeah, all right. You know. Wait. That's right. There were horses. Turns out he was staring at a pomegranate. <laughs> Hey, that's a stupid, vague enough reference to end on. <laughs> oh, and Duh, the... what? Oh, wait. Oh, please have a Titan face show up in the background. Perfect way to end the episode. Okay, I guess we'll see you next time. Let's play Sonic Adventure. <laughs> ah!